Hi there, Tony Sycamore here, IG's Market Analyst for Australia. The ASX 200 healthcare sector is the third largest sector in the ASX 200 and consists of 14 companies that offer investors exposure to cutting-edge science and medical research and care. The healthcare sector is considered a defensive sector because there isn't a lot of scope to cut back on essential medical and healthcare costs during more challenging economic times. However, that hasn't stopped the healthcare sector from losing 13% this year, with the falls really accelerating post-June. The most prominent member of the healthcare sector is biotech giant CSL, which has a market cap of $115 billion, making it the third largest stock in the ASX 200, which means that fluctuations in the share price of CSL directly influence also the performance of the ASX 200 healthcare sector. Now, the decline in the ASX 200 healthcare sector is currently eyeing a band of support, which I'm about to share with you. The band of support that I'm talking about comes from this high from August 2018, coming in around 34,831, and which picks up the COVID crash March 2020 low, coming in around 33,730. So we can see that the healthcare sector's low last week isn't far from the top of that band of support. Now, what we'd expect to see as it approaches this level of support is that the decline starts to fall. I would also expect to see at least initially a bounce from this level of support. So what we can say here is the ASX 200 healthcare sector is approaching support. Now, when we drill down into CSL on the weekly charts, we get a similar story also materialising. This is the August 2018 high, uh, coming in around $232. And then what you can see across here is a level of support coming from the COVID crash 242 low, which picks up another low coming in around March 2021. And of course, this 240 low for February 2022. What we know is there is an area of support here reinforced by this August 2018 high. So what I'm looking for is for CSL to actually hold the ASX 200 healthcare sector together. I think we should start to see some basing or some buying emerge in this area here, which needs to really hold to prevent CSL falling back down towards $200. But providing we do see that basing, we can already already start to see that with this, uh, this shadow or wick sitting below the bottom of this candle. Buyers have already started to make their presence felt. Now, it's too early to say that a bottom is in place, but what we do know at this point of time is there is a very good level of support coming in here and also in the healthcare sector that should start to provide some support for both CSL and the healthcare sector. Thank you for listening. 